in this video i'm going to show you how to do the unboxing and complete setup of your canon pixima g7020 wireless printer this this is a mega ink tank printer and you can do the copy print scan and fax with it it also has a adf tray so you can use it for copying or scanning multiple pages this printer can print up to 6000 into 3 black pages and 7700 color pages so this printer can print 13 black pages per minute or 6.8 color pages per minute is compatible with your laptop macbook or your smartphone this is a perfect printer for home or office use let's start with unboxing here we have the power cable you also get two other cables on this side we have the print head that is one that is color in the box you also get three black ink bottles so that's a lot of ink plus three color bottles you have manual and the starting booklets and this is our black print head take the printer out of this box remove the protective tape lift it and remove from the sides lift this chamber there are lot of tapes here so you can just take it out also take this covering out lift this section remove it and close it so press it down first step is to plug in the power cable so that's the power cable plug it in at the back of the printer will at the back first step is to install the print heads and to fill the ink tank lift it from here inside you will see this is the area to install the print heads lift this blue button like up and then you can just unlock this area now take the print heads out of the plastic packaging I remove this orange seal and also remove the seal from the front now place b means black so place it here just leave it here and slide it automatically it will sit in its position that is the second color remove seal from the both side and then you have to place it here now close it push it down once you hear a lock sound that means it is installed properly once you close it you have to press these buttons and lock the print heads next step is to install the ink so start with the color or black so right now i'm just going to start with the yellow open the bottle and you can just place it here so that is completely filled in and then you can just take it out close the bottle close the seal and go for the next just match the color like magenta yellow and just place it here you may have to shake a little bit once you hear the bubbles then it will just fill up quickly close it and go for next close it close this side go to the black that is here lift it so we have three bottles if you want you can 
put one two or you can put all three so right now I'll just place the one bottle so that is empty we can just take it out close this section now you just have to press it little bit down with pr little pressure and then it will close itself now switch on the printer press the power button on the display panel we have to select the language so press ok click yes it's going to take few minutes in the meantime we will just load the paper tray so slide the paper tray out adjust the size and load a4 size or letter size paper close it we just wait it will so it's asking to improve the print quality so click yes so we have already installed the paper press ok ok click on the stop once you see ready to connect click on the stop button and you will see the main screen that shows Wi-Fi setup for that press ok connect to a computer or smartphone yes press ok it's going to take around 4 minutes For the line event it will take around 4 minutes so it's just doing the automatic print head alignment. Press OK. Scroll ahead and look for manual connect. It will give you the list of Wi-Fi networks. We just have to select our Wi-Fi and enter that password. Select your Wi-Fi. Press OK. Again press OK to enter the password. To enter the password we can use this button for uppercase or lowercase for example if you press this one it will make the alphabets uppercase numbers lowercase and use here to enter once you enter the complete password press ok button printer is connected with the wi-fi network press ok again now we can start using this printer for copy and if you add this printer in a smartphone you can use it for the wireless printing and scanning let's do a copy and then we will do the printing and scanning for copy you can use the scanner bed or you can also use the ADF tray place a page go to the printer display panel on the main screen click on the copy button so that is on the top right hand side here that is the copy mode if you want you can increase the number of copies and then you can click on the green button for printing in color or black just the black so it will start the Let's do the wireless printing and scanning. For that you have to download the Canon Print app. So go to your smartphone. Download the Canon Print app from the app store. In this app we have to add the printer. Click on the add switch or if you have the option add printer you can select on that. So I'm just waiting. Click on the add switch. Register printer. Printer will display on the main screen. 
select Canon G7000 series so it will give you the series number not the exact model number of the printer print is installed you can close the window you will see printer on the top and we can start using it for printing and scanning for printing select any document you can also print photos with it click next click on the print icon so it is printing Let's do the scanning. For that, we can use the scanner bed or we can use the ADF tray. So, right now, I'm just going to use the ADF tray to scan two pages. Place them here. So, that is like this. Go to the smartphone screen and you can go back to the main screen. Click on the scan icon and just click on the scan Scan is transferred. This way we can do the complete setup of the printer and then we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning. Hopefully you enjoy the video. This will help you to set up your printer. Thanks for watching.